Jennifer with DP Addiction Adventures and I am still coming out of the cold from hell but um, I, I'm getting there. So I wanted to come downstairs to my craft area and do a post review. So update right now my husband is still on his um, IV he's got a couple more days left um, we go and see the specialist again on Monday um, so things are kind of crazy here um, I don't know if we'll even get Christmas decorations up so I don't know if anybody out there understands um, you know somebody who is ill around the holiday time and just and just trying to survive and that's kind of where we're at um, my cold is getting better I just basically have this really deep cough and um, snot issue I know TMI that will not go away um, my husband keeps saying take cold medication but when I do take it for some reason this time around um, any cold medication I take exasperates and so my symptoms magnify and get worse. So I've decided, you know, just lots of tea, lots of vitamins, lots of rest. Um, I'm really glad for the four day weekend um, so I can get lots of sleep. <coughs> and that being said, I am so excited to be back. Um, I just have missed you guys. I've been following as much as I can um, all the YouTube videos and Facebook and different things like that. So right now I'm set up upstairs in our living room instead of our family room because my husband can't really do stairs right now. So we borrowed a TV so I didn't have to bring the TV up from our family room and set that up. And we're kind of just stationed on our own little island of overstuffed furniture. Everybody has a TV tray and we just kind of veg out. Um, so I have a TV. It's not even like Ella's TV tray. It's literally the size of this pink pad, which is about 18 inches by, um, I don't know, 16 inches. And most of my, so this is a 30 by 40 most of my diamond paintings are like what you see under here um, 40 by 50 or larger so it's been kind of interesting there's been diamonds going everywhere and I'm running up and down the stairs because I you know forgot my tweezers or I forgot scissors or I need another you know one of these because the diamond painting I'm working on is smaller so I'm not using one of these craziness right so <coughs> excuse me thank you for hanging in there with me I have um, two post reviews I hope to film tonight and then I do have a work in progress that I want to do um, like a, a tag or a drill with me or stick with me whatever we want to call it so anyway those are my updates got them done in under five minutes Hang in there. Here we go. So, this is the one that we're going to review today, the green one. Now, this green one I call Crystal Doll. It's a kimono doll. Um, this is the one that I did in the hospital, well, partially in Washington, D.C. Um, if you want to watch the stick with me, doo -doo, I'll put up in the eye. And then the rest of it I did in the hospital sitting at the bedside <clears throat> excuse me of my husband so I really liked how it turned out it is a custom and um, most there's like a dozen or two dozen of these um, all over Aliexpress different kinds sorry there's a one that's not gonna make me happy so I'm gonna replace that um, while I talk so I can't talk and yeah so yeah I did this one um, as you can see right here these are all over Aliexpress but they're in the opaque drills and I saw on DIY DIY moon sorry if I got that wrong 
this done in a crystal and I absolutely loved it but it was $78 plus $40 shipping now I love her designs I don't want to take them by any means um, but because this is so common out there I took it and gave it to um, one of the AliExpress people and asked if they could do it in a crystal for me and this is what I got so I do like how it turned out it's super sparkly <coughs> And at first, I was a little bit like, oh my gosh, is this even going to look right? But it does. It does. And um, the unboxing got 4 and 4.75 stars. The only thing that didn't get a full star was the canvas quality. And if you watch my re um, unboxings, it's to get a full star for canvas quality, you have to be at a level like a diamond art club or even a DIY moon or a diamond dots something that puts you just a step above average so most people do not get a full five stars um, for the unboxings and it's not their fault it's just the materials they use <coughs> excuse me so for the post review I gave it a 0.75 star for canvas glue this is like, was it completely sticky or was it slippery? Like when you put it down and your diamonds go like that. Um, were there rivers? Were there bubbles? Etc. There were a few spots on here. Oh, I don't think you can tell from the back. There were a few spots on here that were a little bit slippery or didn't stick quite as well. And I didn't know if that was due to just the crystals because you've got that... Excuse me, I dropped something. You've got that paint on the back of the crystal to help, you know, give it its color. I um, didn't quite know, but it just wasn't quite up to par. Um, symbol clarity, you can see right here. I mean, they were decent. I don't know if that's going to focus too well. Sorry, guys. Hello, focus. I don't know what's going on. Well, even though it's not focusing, oh, hello, right here. Anyway, it doesn't want to focus. Um, they're so distinct enough that it was super easy to follow. And so, yeah, I gave it a full star. Drill quantity and quality. Now, sometimes crystals get a lot of crap because um, number one, you can see I had leftovers of every single one, okay? Um, number two, the quality was great. There were a couple that, you know, didn't have the backing quite right or they were chipped, different things like that. But overall, um, sorry, I was at the hospital, so I used post-it notes to <coughs> crack myself up to, and then I knew that was 310. And I lost these two post-it notes. Um, so yeah, I sometimes crystals get a lot of crap, but um, I got the quality was fine, and I had plenty. Excuse me. Oh, there's my yawn. Design success. I gave a point seven five, um, only because I thought that it. I don't know. I just felt like some of the green, you can't see it in the camera, but I felt like some of the shading or the way it, it could come together. And again, this was, you know, off of a picture that was in translated. Um, I also felt like they did a aqua and a light green to try to get this teal. And I think I would have liked it better if it was just like a teal color instead of these two. Because when you're up close, let me see if I can get this. I don't know why. Guys, I'm so sorry. When you're up close, and I know diamond paintings aren't supposed to be seen up close. But it just, it's a little off-putting. And I 
So I just didn't, I don't know. And the experience, besides having to do it in the hospital, <laughs> it's not Diamond Painting's fault. Um, I gave a full star for experience because I just, I had a lot of fun. And also like all the nurses that would come in and the technicians, I could introduce them. Oops. Sorry about that. Um, I could introduce them to diamond painting. I did have one of the technicians who comes in and gives um, the vitals come and ask me like, how do I seal my diamond paintings? Cause she's into diamond painting, but um, had not realized. She also didn't realize there was such a huge following on YouTube. So I introduced her to some of you guys and the aqua glue. I also gave her like the Elmer's glue. Um, different options like that and told her just to kind of have fun and research and go um, oh I missed one right here oh my goodness guys okay so 14 so we've got 4 8 12 13 14 luckily I knew kind of how I distributed them in oh no I lost <coughs> excuse me I thought I could have a milkshake but evidently which I know this a milkshake oh my goodness guys um a milkshake actually causes your phlegm to go into overdrive so I'm like great that was really awesome that I decided to have a milkshake before I started filming. There it is. Okay. I don't... Seriously? Get in there. I don't think that's the right... Color. I think I'm going crazy. Yeah. I have these in here wrong. I was like light pink and when all the others are purple? Seriously. All right. Let's try this again. Um, yeah, this is me not on cold medication, right? Seriously. So that's kind of where I'm at um, as far as an update is concerned. This post review, I definitely would buy it again. Um, I haven't switched over yet to do... Um, the red one, I'm currently working on Girl in the Elephant. So I've got that one going on. So, yep, so here's my post review. It is my kimono doll. Um, I don't know why that got dark all of a sudden. Let's see if I can get it a little bit lighter. Um, the kimono crystal doll. And it's a 30 by 40, but we did measure it. The canvas is 30 by 40, so it's a little bit smaller. Um, it had 16 colors. It was special crystals. And it was from the um, Leogion official store, which I'll put a link to the store down below because this was a custom. And this particular store, if you watched my um, unboxing, which I'll put up here, um, this particular store does have everything in a round square or crystal offered on their website and it's the pebble stones that are the crystal. They do have a magic round. It'll throw you off, but it's just round. And then they have square and then they have pebble and this, if you look at the pictures, um, this is the pebble and then they also do customs and crystals as well. <sighs> Excuse me. So I started this on November 7th because I did it. Oh, actually started it much earlier because I was in Washington, D.C. Um, and I completed it on November 11th. So it took me about two weeks, but I wasn't doing this all the time. Um, I have to look up when I started in Washington. So yeah, that's it, everybody. Thank you so much for bearing with me as I go all over the place. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't, let me know why so I can become better as a YouTuber. Otherwise, until next time, I'll see you later. Take care and be blessed.